Hi, I'm Aubrey Sewell, and this is my TED Talk on how the sun impacts our lives. How much time do you think you've spent in the sun in the past week? According to researchers, more than 42% of people do not get enough sun in their day-to-day -day lives. The average person should spend 15 to 30 minutes in the sun at least three times a week, and two-thirds of Americans do not get enough sun to support a regular vitamin D level. But I am a person who loves spending time in the sun, and I'm here to explain how impactful it can be on your life. I enjoy spending time in the sun because it makes me happy and it's a free way to enhance my mood. Another reason I love the sun, especially sunsets, are because they help me to be present in the moment and they help me appreciate the world around me. And for me, the sun helps to provide peace, calmness, and relieves my stress. I first began thinking about how the sun affected my life when I noticed that my mood was significantly different during times when there was a lot of sun compared to when there was little sun in my life. In the most recent experience I had, I was spending hours in the sun every day, and one of the most recent times I experienced this was over spring break when I went to Cabo. While I was on this trip, I was spending long periods of time in the sun every day, and I noticed that at the end of the day, I seemed a lot happier when I was in the sun compared to when I was not in the sun. After realizing how much I enjoy the sun, I started doing some research and came across this definition, which is heliophilia, and it comes from the Greek language, and it's the desire to stay in the sun or the love of sunlight. So I began wondering why I felt like the sun had such a huge impact on my life, so I started researching it. So these are statistics on the people who suffer from seasonal affective disorder, which it can also be called SAD or seasonal depression. And the graph on the left shows that only 5% of the population is diagnosed with high levels of seasonal depression, but as you can see, 20% or more experience milder forms of it. So that means that during the colder months, 20% or more of the population feels more lonely or sad compared to how they feel in the warmer months. And in the graph on the right, you can see that January and February are the months where the people with seasonal depression struggle the most. And this is because during these months, this is when the sunlight is not as present. So what is seasonal depression? Seasonal depression is triggered by a lack of sunlight in the winter months, and four out of five people who experience seasonal depression are women. And these symptoms can include feeling down, overeating, being tired consistently, and having a difficult time making or keeping friends. So some benefits of the sun are mood. It can help to boost your mood and increase serotonin levels. It can help with stress by relieving stress because it brings peace. It can help with better sleep and it can help with your mental health because it brings you calmness. It can also provide vitamin D, which is an essential nutrient to the body, and it can strengthen your bones and also tan your skin. Okay, so ways to boost your mood during the winter. You can try exercising outside. You can get more sleep. You can even try taking vitamin D supplements and you can make sure that you maintain a healthy and consistent diet. You can also get social and hang out with your friends and family, or you can relax, or you can even try light therapy. Sorry. <laughs> Okay, um, so how you can get more sun in your day-to-day -day life, you can try moving your exercises from inside to outside, you can move your hobbies outside, you can try eating outside, or you can move your workspaces outside, and if you feel like you're spending a lot of time inside, you can even try taking short breaks during the day. So why is this important? The sun is very important because it helps to expand your life and boost serotonin. And the sun has many countless benefits, 
Not only does it increase your lifespan, but it generates calmness, happiness, and energy and motivation. So make sure that you are taking advantage of the most beautiful planet we have.